So this is my before video. everybody and welcome back to my channel if you're new here i'm sending you the warmest welcome today's video is going to be filmed over the week sorry if i feel so seem to have tired it's quarter past six in the morning but i've decided to be in a calorie deficit this more this week and i have to be in work by about quarter past seven so i've woken up super early to make myself some breakfast and this is what i've got so I've got some porridge with some bananas, pears and I say a little bit of cinnamon sprinkled on top but I accidentally sprinkled a lot. I've got an orange and a elderflower and mint detox tea. I will pop my ending calories on the screen at the end of today. So for my mid-morning snack I have this triple chocolate cake bar. This is from Fibre One and just look at that, for 90 calories, eating healthy is actually really good. And I've just got some of my juice. So for my lunch, I have some carrot and coriander soup, which is only 112 calories. And I have one crumpet with some butter on. Good evening, everybody. So tonight's tea is half a packet of roast chicken and bacon pasta and sauce. This is 227 calories and then to up my calories i've just done myself a little feast so i've got two tempura prawns two duck spring rolls two mozzarella sticks and two chicken skewers and a little bit of barbecue sauce and then all of this bit is 228 calories i think so all in all this meal is under 500 calories so it's not bad at all and it's all my favourite yummy foods. To end my evening off, I'll be having this gingerbread hot chocolate as a late night snack. I will pop the calories on the screen right now of today. My intake should be 1,800. So therefore, I have been in a calorie deficit today. I also have been working so... I have burnt off a few calories, which is good. So tomorrow is a brand new day and we will see what it entails. Good night, everybody. Good morning, guys. So day two's breakfast consists of poached eggs on toast, a cup of tea and a bowl of pears. I'm having quite a substantial breakfast today because me and my friends are off to the Chinese tonight. So I won't be having any lunch. I'll be saving my calories for tonight. I did leave my eggs in a bit too long, so let's see if they're nice and runny. Oh, they are as well. They're still nice and runny. Mm -mm -mm. Hello, everybody, and welcome to day three. Now... I haven't filmed any food today for the simple fact because I haven't eaten any. So after the Chinese last night that me and Abby had, we came back to mine and we got drunk basically. So I consumed a lot of alcohol and we had some donuts. So I definitely, definitely exceeded my calorie deficit yesterday. Well, my calorie intake yesterday. So, and... I say for that reason I haven't eaten. It's not, it's because simply I haven't felt like eating. I've been feeling very rough this morning. But tonight me and Carl are going on a double date, so we're actually going out for food. So I've been saving all my calories really for that tonight. And I haven't really been feeling hungry, so I haven't really been wanting to eat for the sake of it. So when we go out for food tonight, I will show you what I have. morning everybody so for my breakfast this morning i have a big bowl of porridge banana with some honey drizzled on top and a nice hot cup of tea for my mid-morning snack i'll be having this fiber one birthday cake bar these are so delicious 
especially warmed up in the microwave and I'll be finishing my first bottle of squash. So for my lunch I have some carrot and coriander soup which is only 112 calories and I have one crumpet with some butter on. For my tea tonight I have this half a pizza from Aldi. It's mozzarella, basil and tomato. These are so yummy and then I'll have it with a little bit of mayonnaise and then for my pudding I'm going to have this white chocolate flavour light and free yoghurt which is only 57 calories and I'm also going to have a salty caramel Twix just for a little bit of sugar. To end the evening I'm just going to chill in bed with one of my detox teas and I will pop the amount of calories I've had on the screen today. As usual, I am definitely in a calorie deficit and I definitely needed to be after the past few days. Good night. Good morning, everybody, and welcome to day five. So for my breakfast, I have this massive bowl of porridge with some honey, bananas and blueberries. And of course, as always, my cup of tea. As it's that time of the month for me at the moment, I'm having a second breakfast this morning. I've decided to have this because usually I just snack on rubbish and I'm trying to be really healthy and eat quite clean. So I thought this was the best option for me. So as my second breakfast, I have a poached egg on toast with some black pudding. For my tea tonight, I have this sausage and feta salad. So we have sausages, feta cheese, fajita, mushrooms, cucumber, pepper, tomato and lettuce. I've calculated all of the calories for this and I'll put it on at the, at the end of the day. And I'm going to sprinkle some mayonnaise on top. For my pudding, I'm going to be having two of these little moons from Aldi and they are 70 calories each. For my evening snack, I'm going to have a cup of tea and two of these biscuits and then I'm going to head off to bed. So I will put my ending calories on the screen right now for today and I will see you all tomorrow. Good night. For my breakfast this morning, I have two wheat bix with some blueberries, banana. I have a cup of tea and one of these Fibre One triple chocolate cake bars. For my lunch, I had this salad bap, and in mine, I had some coronation chicken and some lettuce. And then on the side, we had a little bit of quiche to go with it. We are having this curry for tea and having it with rice. I have no idea what the calories are in this, but it's got lots of veggies, chicken, and the sauce. Because I'm at my mum's this weekend, I won't be really counting the calories, but I will be including everything that I eat. And then for pudding, we have this apple crumble and it will be served with custard. For my breakfast this morning, I have a cup of tea and half a bowl of Alpen with some milk. For Sunday lunch, we had this gorgeous roast with chicken and all of the vegetables and some gravy. And this is my after video. <laughs> going to go ahead and end this video as you can see a being in a calorie deficit definitely definitely works and that's why i wanted to do this video was to show you guys that all these fad diets and being on a certain diet and eating certain foods doesn't always work for everybody but if you find out how many calories you're supposed to eat a day and eat below that allow your treat a self treat sometimes it works as you've seen i've only been in it for a week i don't weigh myself just because this week has been the time of the month so obviously if i hadn't have like 
on the scales lost anything I'd have been disappointed but I feel like taking pictures and physical weight loss as in like when you can see it is so much better and so much more motivating so if you're feeling in a rut with food at the moment and you feel like you've put on a bit of weight go onto the NHS website figure out your calories and just eat below your calories and you will lose weight instantly I really hope this video has helped some of you and that you can take something from it. If you enjoyed, please give this video a thumbs up, subscribe down below and I'll see you in my next one.